Steve Morgan, Fishing Monthly Magazines on the Yamaha stand, Sydney Boat Show with Glenn Gibson. And Glenn, behind us is a concept engine which is turning a lot of heads here today. Exactly right. The manufacturer, the original guy that created the XTO engine, which is that's the platform, has done something really special with it, looking at multiple technologies and now come up with the first hydrogen marine engine. Now, hydrogen, I think of hydrogen and I think, oh, high density, it's going to be a powerful propeller to use. And, and a lot of people in the marketplace sort of shy away from electrics. They want something that mimics what they've already got on their boat. That's exactly right. We've gone down an automotive path where electrification and hybrid is something that we hear a lot of. But now we're looking at exploring other opportunities as well. And I urge people to jump onto YouTube, Google a hydrogen engine and look at this video behind us because you'll see just the effort that they're putting in to be able to create, create these gas chambers in the boat to be able to give this thing the power that it needs to get onto the water. I think uh, one thing's for certain in the future that fossil fuels aren't going to be as readily available and as cheap as they are now and these options are going to become, I suppose, increasingly affordable for people. Exactly right. And this is a concept engine, so there is a lot of work to do yet. So this thing we're here, we're going to get this onto the water later this year in Jacksonville in the United States. Super keen to see what the performance results are. But fingers crossed, we're hoping for some really good things. Well, there you go. Uh, I don't think anyone in the marine industry knows exactly what boating is going to look like in 20 years, but you can tell the guys from Yamaha are not going to die wondering.